Today we're actually going to look at how to optimize Batman Arkham Knight. Um, I originally wasn't going to do this video in hopes that they would actually create a fix for it or give the option to edit the options. Um, but it's been two weeks and I haven't seen them make any changes. So I'm going to show you how to unlock the 30 frames per second and also do a little bit of optimization so hopefully your gaming experience can be a little better. Um, I am enjoying the game myself, but there are some, uh, th there are some points and times in the game where it just lags and maybe drops down to like 10 to 15 frames a second. And I'm running a Toxic R9 270 Sapphire, and it still does this. So, to begin, obviously, we're going to open Steam. Go ahead and highlight Batman Arkham Knight. We're going to right-click and go to Properties. Under Properties, we're going to go to Local Files, and we're going to browse the local files. Once there, a little folder's going to pop up. We're going to go to BM Game, and then go into the config folder. Now, once in the config folder, what we're going to be looking for is BM System Settings .ini. Um, now, if you double click it, it may ask you how to open it. Usually, you want to open it with Notepad. You could also right click, open with Notepad, and it'll pop right up. So now we have all the settings of the game, and we can actually do some stuff. So first we want to fix the frames per second issue. It is locked at 30, so you can either find FPS or go to Edit, Find, and just type FPS and search it. So it's here, Max FPS. Now mine is set to 60. If you have not modified it at all, it's going to be set to 30. So what you can do is you can set it to 60 or even 120, depending on your hardware, and it should increase it. Okay, and next we're going to actually, um, we're going to mess with the DirectX 9 setting. And for that, we're going to search Ballo D3D9MSAA. Now, this is going to allow you to use MSAA with DirectX 9. It is set to false. Go ahead and change that to true. And next we're going to mess with the texture resolution. So let's search texture. Oh, that's mobile. Okay. So texture res. Now it's set to zero for texture resolution resolution. Now if you want it locked at normal you can use 1. If you want a little higher texture resolution you can hit 2. So once you've made these changes go ahead and save it and run the game. And you should see some mild improvement. Once again this is this greatly depends on your hardware. Um, if, if you don't have the hardware to back up the game obviously it's still not going to run all that great and this this is an issue in the game itself so improvements are going to be very minimal but it will in fact improve it so and that's it that's all you need to unlock the frames per second and bump it up a little bit um, obviously if it's still lagging you may want to lower your resolution in game other than that you should be good to go uh, Go ahead. If you like this video, go ahead and subscribe to me below, and let me know what your uh, what your experience is, and let me know um, how it works for you. Thank you.